Hi friends, welcome back to my channel and a very good morning to all in this video. As you can see this uh, thumbnail, we have clearly said that Nifty, I mean Nifty 50 has a great chance to hit 11,600 points. In this video, I am going to say what are the reasons and what are the conditions to want to, you want to see in this uh, time. Okay, uh, now what are the uh, conditions and what are the precautions that one should take for the rally that we are going to see in the future date in maybe in august month so before all saying this let us now see how the sd infinity is performing actually if we consider friends uh, the nifty closed yesterday at 11,131. now the sd infinity is trading in the range of 11,176. that means at least 50 points extra uh, sd infinity is trading i think it is a good good a uh, starting is good uh, for uh, SGF Nifty and as well as our, our Nifty. Yesterday, US markets performed very well, uh, especially NASDAQ also performed well. So, today, if you see, if you put a simple calculation, uh, FMCG companies plus Reliance plus tech companies equal to bank loss, and that is what happened yesterday also. If you consider a simple uh, technique, even though when the Reliance tried to move up a lot, even though when the uh, tech companies try to move up a lot. Tech companies, including Infosys, Tech Mahindra, uh, you could say TCS Limited. So, if we consider all those companies, they have been rising steadily. But on the other side, banks have a major weight in the index. I think 31% is a weight in the index of Nifty. So, that fall is enough. I think even after posting a good result by ICC Bank, the market did not favor those results. And Kotak Mahindra's bank result was a bit normal. Okay. So, what are the stocks that I would watch out for today i think i, I would be i would be watching out for uh, alok industries reliance in i mean i mean group companies it is related to reliance industries because why i'm saying this because uh morgan stanley as i mean i mean i, I mean I, it is not morgan stanley but on uh, rating agency or one buyer has said that reliance industries will go to 2350 and that is also the first point the second point is that the quarter result of reliance industries is coming already in the agm mukesh amani said that they will be trying to uh inculcate this uh, retail investors into their uh, reliance retail limited and spun off their oil business into a certain extent so let us know i mean they I mean people will be eager to know how the management is trying to perform this kind of activities and second stock that i would watch out for today would be idfc first prime because the, i mean that is one of our picks and uh, we believe that today result would be positive for idfc first bank their retail book i think i mean i think their retail book is not at all danger i mean uh, it's a little bit danger but it's not overall danger if you compare with other corporate loan books and infra loan books i'm going to see the pci coverage ratios as well as this company's balance sheet and the third stock i would watch for today is that nestle industries nestle is also have nestle limited nestle also is having the result today i hope it I mean, it would be definitely positive only i believe so okay so result reaction i believe tech Mahindra company has posted a research set of results and those results would be factored, factored into the market. Now, uh, coming on to the main topic, 11,600. And how I said 11,600 and why I said 11,600, what are the reasons that 11,600 could be achieved and what are the reasons that 11,600 could not be achieved okay so friends uh, let let me let me put a simple calculation for you around the 600 points okay now the market is 11,131 right icc bank result hdfc bank uh, retract rate I mean retract rate means it is fallen a lot so uh, right jumping around 100 rupees uh, nasdaq price momentum will infuse the uh, what is it, infuse the price in the action for the it stocks like uh, this many stocks so if you put a simple calculation, if you put a simple calculation, you will be knowing that Nifty can easily go to 11,250 or 11,280. 11,250 is the first resistance point. And what will happen that uh, maybe June again to the August first week, I think the Supreme Court of Asia, the judgment is also coming for both uh, Bharati Airtel. Uh, word of phone idea and Tata daily services. Okay, so these three companies will be in focus. You remember one thing at least in the nifty surface. Okay, so I mean leave over to order phone ideas also can rise But the judgment is positive then the actual momentum can pick if the added momentum is going to pick the banks related to that company can also pick if order of phone ideas is outcomes positive then the banks related to it can also be positive. What are the banks? Instant bank, HDFC bank. So there would be again price pressure in the momentum. So Put together, if the 
Reliance Industries is also going to come, then the market can go up to 11,400 points. Now, the S-200 points, why? Uh, yesterday, uh, Competition Committee of India, I mean, I think it, it is CCA, uh, spoken to this RBI governor regarding restructuring of loans and we don't need any further more because uh, people are misusing it. I mean, you could also go and see. So, I mean, RBA will definitely think about it. So, if August 2 to August 6, I think that is the meeting for range for RBA meeting. In that meeting, if they give any intimation regarding restructuring of loans, it could be a living opportunity for each and every bank in the market. I think lastly, it has happened in the 2000 financial crisis where the whole market felt like a scrap. I think that is, I mean, this time there is even more danger than during those times. So put together all the factors are placed in. I think today market will be in positive. Why I am saying because uh, uh, from Thursday onwards the market has been hitting uh, harder and harder. Especially HDFC Bank has been uh, put to a harder level. You know one thing HDFC Bank delivery percentage has gone 51% is today. I mean yesterday's uh, trading in NSE. So accumulation has been done. Let us see how it's going to pan out. I am going to wait and watch for the first 10 or 15 minutes today's market trade. Then I will pounce and buy some of the nifty stocks if I want to trade. So what are the nifty stocks I would have also thought today? I would be watching Tech Mahindra, even Reliance Industries, HDFC Bank, ICC Bank. I think today's trade could be, today's date or trade could be bank stocks. I mean, this many days, this stocks have been fallen. Even I mean, today bank stocks will also support this IT stocks in the price rising. So let us see how it's going to pan out. Pharma stocks could have a little bit wobbly thing. So be careful with the pharma stocks. Okay friends. And this is about the market update. We just going to make sure you please click the subscribe button. As well as you please share this video to your friends. So that all could get the knowledge about Nifty, Bank Nifty, etc. Thank you friends. And I see you in the video very soon.